Saransky come to visit our school. He's a great leader in education. We asked him some important questions about education. Let's go meet him. Today is a very special day because the Deputy Chancellor is in our school. The Deputy Chancellor plays a very important role in the education of New York City students. Welcome, Mr. Saransky. This is Madeline speaking. We have read that you would like to change testing in New York City and around the nation. What about them would you change? That's a good question, Madeline. I really think that when we do assessments in school, it should really help us understand what kids are thinking. So I want to see more writing, and I want to see more projects where kids really have to solve problems. I don't like the bubble tests where it's just A, B, C, D. I really want to know that if you learn something that you can explain it. I have never had a very big test before because I'm in the second grade. What are some tips um, to get a good grade? Well, one, I wouldn't get too nervous. I think it's important because if you, if you do your work in class, you're going to do a good job on the test. And as you're preparing in third grade to get ready for it, make sure you're doing all your homework, that you're doing all your assignments. And the more you read and the more that you write, the better you're going to do. Hi, Chancellor Sharansky. This is Amy speaking. We've also heard that you used to be a math and social studies teacher. What was your favorite memory as a teacher? So I'll, I'll tell you a funny story. It was a little bit embarrassing, though. Um, when I was a first year teacher, one of my students went to camp the summer before, and we were, I was teaching sixth grade. And at the camp, they had animals, and they gave him a rabbit. And he brought the rabbit home to stay with him in his apartment, but his mom said no. So he came to school and he said, could we keep the rabbit, please? Can we keep the rabbit in the classroom? So I was like, okay, yeah, if you promise to clean its cage and take care of it, that'll be fine. And it was fun, like, everyone liked the rabbit, people would pet it, people took good care of it. It was a good thing. But one day, I had forgotten my chalk. And I told one of the students, could you clean the board for me because I'm gonna go get some chalk so we can start class. And this student was a little bit of a jokester. He liked to play pranks. I came back and he was erasing the board with the rabbit. <laughs> And everyone was laughing, and it was a little bit embarrassing for the rabbit, um, and for me. Hi, this is Evelyn. Nice to meet you. I have heard you made a lot of changes through the year. What do you want to change next? Hi, Evelyn. Nice to meet you, too. Um, I want to see schools do much more writing and practicing with writing. So, I mentioned that when we were talking about the assessments. But I think the way that you get to be ready when you graduate high school for college is starting when you're little to read a lot and to write a lot. And that's a big change I'd like to see. Thank you for coming to our wonderful school. You made the luncheon show worth watching. We hope, you can, we hope you can, we can interview you later in the future. Thank you. So there you have it. Tests are going to become more challenging. They'll include more writing and less multiple choice. A good way to practice is by reading and writing for fun. Chancellor Saransky was a great person to meet. We hope to see him soon.